Hello everyone. Today in this video we are going to see cortical thumb sign. And as the name suggests, thumb. Here the thumb is involved and cortical. Cortical means cortex, the highest part of our brain that controls our entire body. So when there is a certain pathological indication with position of the thumb indicating some damage in the cerebral cortex then it is known as cortical thumb sign now let us see what it is cortical thumb sign is slight adduction and flexion that is adduction and flexion of thumb within the palm so it is also known as thumb in palm position or thumb in palm deformity or fisting hands now this position is seen normally in newborn babies yes if you notice then all the newborn babies have tendency to keep their thumb fisted like this and it is seen up till 1.5 to 3 months of age so up till 1.5 to 3 months of age if a baby is keeping the hand like this then it is normal but if it is extending beyond 3 months of age if the child is keeping their thumb fisted like this beyond three months of age then it is indicating that there is some damage in the cerebral cortex that is the higher center the upper motor neuron is damaged so now if a child is keeping the thumb fisted like this beyond three months of age then it is a red flag for underlying cerebral damage or brain damage and the first person to screen this is a pediatrician yes pediatrician is the first person who will be screening your child for any pathological or abnormal condition now what are the other things that you as a parent you need to observe in a child if a child is having cortical thumb sign and it's beyond three to four months of age you need to check whether your baby is keeping their hands or their upper limb or their legs tightly bent like this or they are resistive to any kind of movement even if you are trying to move their hands you are trying to open up their hands trying to move it like this then they are providing some resistance or there is some tightness then yes it is again indicating that there is some issue with development of the child and you need to consult further now if you are sure that your child is having the cortical thumb sign and you need to help your child then here I am suggesting you few ways for cortical thumb sign now before that I would like to request you to subscribe our channel if you have not subscribed it yet then please do subscribe our channel and help us to help more kids and their family members yes now in cortical thumb sign first thing that I am showing over here is the massage and yes please this needs to be done by mother no one else in the family should do this I really request mothers to do this as they are very gentle with the baby and we can prevent any other damages so first thing if a child is having a thumb fisted like this gradually open up the fingers hold it hold it like this or you can take someone's help to hold their hand or fingers then slowly from center of the palm move in a circular direction in the outward direction while you are massaging you can use a simple coconut oil for the same so do it very gently provide five to seven strokes and repeat it at least two times or three times in a day now apart from this splinting of thumb will also help your child to keep it outside the fist or outside the palm for splinting you can consult someone who's uh, making orthosis or orthotic devices they might help you with a tailor-made splint for your baby this splint needs to be well but I won't advocate that it should be worn for 24 hours rather give your child some freedom to hold different objects or different tasks or doing uh, some weight bearing activities will help your child to learn uh, the various ways in which they can move their thumb out 
and they will also be uh, exploring their environment and also give them different textures for tactile sensory input in the palm area you can use different textures like uh, uh, see for example sponge uh, velvet woolen cloth or any uh, silk satin cloth the cotton this can be used to stimulate the tactile sensory uh, aspect of a child's palm and this will also help a child with cortical thumb sign so if you find this video helpful then do share it with other parents and do subscribe to our channel give your suggestions in the comment box below lots of love to all kids thank you